Welcome back to the Angus Report. And joining me again is Josh White with NCBA. And tell us, Josh, what are really the next steps for producers? Um, if a producer really wants to educate themselves on areas that Dr. Niffin and Dr. Belk talked about, how they might could improve their management practices, we have great training tools and resources at bqa.org. We rolled out new modules this year for online training. Of course, uh, if you're in a, in a cattle-centric state, you probably have a great BQA state coordinator that you can get uh, hands-on in-person training with as well. And we're also excited to roll out some transportation modules uh, this fall for, uh, for additional training. Uh, if folks want additional information just on the quality audit, the executive summary and a four-pager are already up on, uh, on the site. Uh, just go to bqa.org and click on the NBQA results. Uh, we'll also be rolling out some additional information throughout the fall, including uh, for the first time in nine years, we've uh, gone back and done the market cow and bull report uh, part of the quality audit. So that'll be posted up later this fall. And that's all the time we have for this week's show. And we definitely thank you, Josh, and our special guests uh, for being in the studio today. And uh, we'll be back this time next week with more from the Angus Report. Thanks for joining us. <music>